horse that we'll be showing you um, on the video. His name is Legends Top Gun. He is a stallion. He's 14 years old. He stands about 15 in horse on the top side, which goes back to the Missouri Traveler, Bo's April Charm, which goes back to Zane Gray, uh, Missouri Bo, uh, Lady Ann on the top side. And on the bottom side, he's out of a mirror called Sensations, Ebony Lace, which goes back to the Little Gray Sensation horse, goes back to the Boogie's Black Angel, which goes back to the Merry Boy Sensation and the Boogeyman. This horse is an excellent, excellent stallion. He's an excellent, excellent riding horse. He is one that um, we had, actually I had bought when he was, I think, four or five months old. Um, I had trained him myself when he was a two-year-old. I showed him as a two and a three-year-old myself. Um, excellent, excellent horse. Then we had Corey Pasco show him as a four and a five-year-old. He was a uh, reserve world grand champion um, in performance. Um, excellent, excellent flat foot walk. Excellent fox trot. He's got a very nice run and walk, and he has a nice camp. He's one that also the year after um, Corey had showed him, Johnny also took him to Ava, and he also won a reserve grand champion again in the model horse. So this horse is, um, has been shown a lot. He is one that... Um, we have even trail ridden some, and to be honest with you, we have not ridden him. We rode him once in the last five years, and that was about uh, three years ago. And it was just to show a customer that wanted to breed to him. Um, I am in a big run um, at the mare barn, and I asked Johnny this morning if he'd get him out and maybe ride him for a couple of days and see if we can put him on video. And um, he got him out and rode him a couple laps and said he's ready. So this horse is one that if someone wanted to take him on and trail ride him or show him or breed him or whatever you want to do, um, he'd be an excellent horse for you. He's also one that we ship semen on. Um, he is, um, we did a bit of semen on him. We actually shipped a lot on him, um, you know, years ago when everyone was breeding more, which that has kind of slacked off a little bit. But anyway, someone looking for a nice, nice horse that is set in all three gates is going to be the same every time you get on him. Um, very, very well-mannered stallion. Um, you can go in the store. Anybody, customers that are down at Brushy Creek, uh, you know, we've had a lot of them come and look at him. Um, or the other stallions that we have, you know, anybody with him, he's very, very good natured. He's been handled a lot. Um, you know, right now we have all of our stallions that have a big, you know, box stall that goes into a huge run. But um, for years, when we did not have the runs for the stallions, we would bring them out every day, handle them every day. Um, they're used to being messed with and, and uh, just really, really um, easy going. We would never have a stallion here that was not. He really throws um, his gait into his offspring. Um, I can go out to the pasture right now. This is his little show canner. But I can go out and pasture right now and tell you exactly which ones are top guns. They always, always have a very, very wavy mane and tail. They have a beautiful, beautiful head. Um, as you can see, he has an, a head like an Arab does. He's just it's gorgeous. Um, he throws that. A lot of them are built the same way he is. Um, he's not a fine build, but he's not a big bone either. He's probably a medium bone um, type of horse. And he throws um, his confirmation, everything about him. You know, he's. I'd have to say he's probably the only stallion that you can really pick out his babies in the in the pasture because they're all built just like him. He's easy to shoe. He's got a phenomenal flat foot walk. That was uh, the best thing about him, I'd have to say, when I was riding him. He's got a very, very nice flat foot walk. He has a nice fox trot. That's what he's doing right there. It's 
very impressive that you can get a stallion out like this that has not really been messed with in five years and um, saddle him and he's going to ride off like this. This is very, very good. and be able to remember to canter on the right lead. <laughs> That's a biggie right there. <laughs> That's really good, Johnny. Anyway, if you're looking to for a breeding stallion that throws exactly what he has in him, he's an, he's an excellent horse for you. If you're looking for a riding horse to breed maybe a few mares with, he'd be a good horse for that too. Um, like I said, he's a 14-year-old stallion. He stands 15 hands, I mean 15-2, and we call him Top Gun. I have to show you this head. It is beautiful. Hi, Gerald. Hi, Lynn. These are the three.